Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play XCOM Terror from the Deep. When we last left off, we have built our fourth base over here in the South Atlantic slash Antarctic region. And uh, now we are patiently waiting for the next terror mission, which regularly appears at the beginning of the month. So... Let's also check the graphs. The activity has dropped, as always. Um, we are researching the iron armor. That's excellent. We are manufacturing gauss pistols. Let's actually sell a few of those for profit. Uh, gauss pistols, we have 20. Let's sell a few. And... Uh, yeah, half a million is much better than quarter of a million. And let's wait. Yeah. So a small UFO, very deep, heading northwest, meaning northwest over there. Let's shoot it down. We haven't fought the aliens with our Barracuda for a longer time now. And unless it wants to land, which it doesn't currently, we should take it down. It's a hit. And it was almost another hit before it decided to outrun us. Okay, this time aggressive... No, still a standard attack, please. Come on. Another hit. It's been hit so many times and it's still not downed. Okay, that's much better. I think we have a, another small mission which we can do right now. Um, pistols 13, okay. Everything else is also fine. We have 14 soldiers. So let's do this. Triton 1. Go to the crash site. Let's begin the mission. Get some uh, stuff from there and sell it for profit. It's only money that we need. And I will even not probably pause the recording here. Let's... Uh, Give this to Danny. Actually, we want to give him the explosive ammunition. That's fine. And let's start. We don't need the thermal tasers, I guess. SpongeBob. Anybody out there? Guess not. Is it a corner? No, it's not a corner. So, go and have a look. nothing. Good. Jellyfish. There is someone over there. Oh, and it's our good old friends, the Aquatoids. Um, hmm. Let's try a snapshot. Didn't work, but somebody else will have a chance to try. Maybe, just maybe, we can uh, use a grenade as well. No, let's not do that just yet. Shanti will for sure be able to kill this alien. Ooh, that was so close. Um, yeah. Let's take another guy. Merlin, you are a sniper. Let's do a aimed shot. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, let's take Mr. Krabs as well. And go over here, scout the rest, nothing, and nothing, okay. Let's take Mac over here and end the turn. We don't need to move all the soldiers, this was a small sub and it's been shot down, meaning there will not be so many aliens on the map, so we can afford to move only with a handful of soldiers. 
And we will have Madeline. Oh, there's the sub, okay. We will have Madeline over here. And he will just kill everybody from the distance. Mag will go the other way and stay here. Shanti, however, will go and help Merlin in case, in a very unprobable case, that he will miss. Okay, that's fine. Where is RP? I want him to see some more action as well. He's right there. Okay. You will go help those two. Whoops. Who was that? Whoops. And who was that? Did I say that will be an easy mission? <laughs> well, it seems like it's not. So. Jellyfish. What do you see? You don't see anything. Come on, that can't be. There was an alien right here. Hmm. That's not good. Mag, you are a heavy soldier. Can you... prime the grenade and throw it over there? here. Don't want to do that too close. Yeah, that should be about right. Who else is a heavy soldier? Merlin is not a heavy soldier, but Shanti is. So, she will take her grenade, prime it, and throw it over here. Yeah, let's see if that helps. Two aliens killed. We didn't even see them, but we saw where they were shooting from, so that helped a lot. And we saw some activity right there, so we will uh, throw a grenade there as well. No unnecessary risks taken. Sea Lion, you are our new scout. Go over there and... Uh, Daisy is also our new scout. You will go there. Perfect. Mag, move a little bit. Okay. That didn't kill anyone. And we saw something in the blackness. So very far away from us. Hmm. Okay. Let's try this side first. Seems to be okay. Seems to be okay. Good, then um, let's move a little. Come on. Let's even take Alex with us. We need a bit more firepower. That's right. Daisy. Over here. That's good. Jellyfish. How much for a snapshot? 18. So you can go one step back and turn around. And even duck. And that didn't help you. <laughs> I'm very sorry, but uh, yeah, that's how it is. Anyway, our new alien grenades, the sonic pulsers, should do the job. I think he was shooting from over here. Mm, that will probably not help. You missed, Daisy. Okay, this is fine. Let's hide there. We are running out of uh, expendable soldiers. Um, hmm. I guess 
I need to start playing more carefully. Again. So, sea lion. Nothing? I guess not. Um, let's move our snipers into position as well. You will go over there. I did actually kill him. There is somebody over there, but we don't care. Let's continue exploring this part of the map. Daisy. Um, you know what? I need you. Let's uh, do this properly and take cover wherever and whenever possible. Okay, then sea lion. Anything? Guess not. Move all the way there and stay there. Whoops, that was not good. I thought he was in cover, but uh, he wasn't. And we have lost already four soldiers, I think. Didn't I tell you this would be a super easy mission? I think I did. <laughs> well, it seems like I have lied. Because it's everything else than an easy mission. We are dropping like flies. Let's kill this one as well. And that was the last alien. So I think we um, killed the majority of the aliens by using grenades. We lost four XCOM operatives. That is incredible. Um, yeah, the artifacts and zerbite and aquaplastics we gained will probably not even cover the costs of uh, hiring four more soldiers. Well, I guess it will, but... It's still a shame I have lost four of them. That should not happen. That was just careless. Anyway, I think we have more stuff to sell. Some corpses, and we even got beaten by aquatoids, by the, the worst aliens. Uh, and by worst, I mean the, the least scary. Okay, Fibroblade MC Reader. We have a lot of pulsers, but they are useful as we have seen. And we have more pistols, excellent. More rifles. We have 400 Zerbite. We could even start selling Zerbite. That's how much we have. So let's actually equip the submarine. Take uh, one, two, three, four guys on the craft again and give them the sonic pistols 14 and 14 14 pulsers 14 flares 7 tasers we don't need the gauze pistol or the gas cannon anymore yeah that's just right perfect okay um yeah we have again one point something million I think it's time to build living quarters in this space as well. Yeah, let's do that. Let's have a look at our research. It's uh, progressing and it should be finished very soon. Okay, let's see what else will happen. Where is the Terra mission? I was expecting, you know, a shipping route or uh, or something to happen. Okay, where is this? Indian Ocean. Okay, so there is something going on over there. Let's send our Triton number two over here. We still don't have the radar capabilities, but in the next day we will. Until then. Ooh, MC Lab is finished as well. And the research is completed. Excellent. Iron armor. Ooh. 
A powerful new protection for Aquanauts, this armor is powered by an iron energy source and greatly amplifies the speed and strength of the wearer. It offers the best protection yet for combat troops. It has a front armor of 132s, basically it's twice as effective as the aquaplastic armor. And it looks really cool. Okay then, um, let's start manufacturing it. And we can even research the magnetic iron armor. Hmm, I guess that will be the um, flying armor, just like from the previous XCOM. But we don't need that just yet. Uh, we will concentrate on... Um, well, we have the armor, now we need the weapons or the subs. Hmm, I guess... I guess we'll go for the weapons. Okay. Oh, actually, we didn't even research the Gilman Corpse. Let's do that. We want to know more about the aliens. Allocate the uh, manufacturing capabilities. Let's put those down to one and start a new production. Iron armor. It requires aquaplastics and zerbite, so it's quite expensive, but we have a lot of zerbite and uh, a decent amount of aquaplastics. So we can afford, let's say, 10, which will cost 50 and 50. Yeah, that's fine. And we want 10 iron armor suits. It will take 21 days. However, it will be worth it. Stay there and patrol. Actually, you don't have to do this anymore because in the middle of nowhere we have the sonar array already. So return to base. Yeah return. Okay, seems like we will not have a Terra mission in April. It's very surprising, but this game has a lot of surprises for us. More activity in Antarctic. Okay, then um, Triton go. Hmm. I don't know, over here. and try to search for more aliens. We have four more soldiers and we will need to rename them very soon. So I guess in the next episode, if we have any good soldiers, we will hire more subscribers. And that will be just cool. The research is completed again. The Gilman autopsy. Once surgery began, it became clear this is no alien. What? But an ancient born... But an earth-born creature, an ancient prehistoric race that was fought destroyed at the very moment mammals became dominant. In, the t in a time when dinosaurs roamed these creatures lived, the Gilman amphibious intelligent and strong. The cataclysm that ended the reptile rule on this planet forced these creatures into a sim... sim biotic relationship with the newly arrived aliens. Wow. A small electronic device is lodged in the skulls of these creatures. So, the Gilman are actually not aliens. Wow, that's that's a nice story. Nice background story. Uh, I can't wait to question one of them alive. So let's actually do that right now. Do we have any live killmen? We have a technician, we have a squad leader. So, uh, technicians will probably tell us more about the subs, which I don't need at this point, but the squad leaders will tell us more about the alien missions on Earth. So let's question a killman squad leader. Excellent. And... Uh, I think now it's time to end the episode and uh, 
will continue next time. So stay tuned, until next time, bye bye.